for those in a clean manner. Sam Hyvie picked up the personal foul there, and they go deep inside again that time to Holmes, who that time converts for the bucket. Or do you try to drive it? So there's the delineation that, that has to be made in terms of shot selection for Indiana. Second opportunity is good for Pat Bird, a little fadeaway jumper. Average is just under 18 points, but nine boards for her, so she's always going to be around the basketball, whether she's shooting it or getting the boards. Here on the push, it's Moore McNeil. And again, they are going to give that touch to Holmes. There's the foul against Kane. I think they were trying to pursue that. Mackenzie Holmes right here, surveying, trying to find a spot, and then going right under, drawing skin right here by Kate Kane right on the arm. Boom. This possession, Nebraska hit its first three-point make here of the game, and now they lose it. Here's Goulbe who picks it up, goes the distance, gets the contact, plus one to the free throw line. Off and running. Yeah, get in the gaps, get two hands on the basketball. Finish strong in transition right here. Got tagged on the way up. Only has seven available players here today. Full Bay going reverse. Hits every part of the rim for it to drop. This afternoon, she has done it all right here, finding the reverse and getting it to drop, staying aggressive and using that glass. Work well for the squad. She picked up her fourth rebound as well. And Indiana on the push. It's Holmes with the finish. Yeah, five fast break points so far for Indiana. Look, it's textbook. Great angles. Push the ball up the floor with the pass. Came so far being left in the game with the two personals. And just about four minutes left to play. Here's the takeaway. Berger to Pepper. Broker knows the last five seconds of that Tennessee game, Lisa is going and fighting for a rebound, she said. She said, I just had to get in there. And, and that's what happened at the very end of that game. She's just so tough-minded and aggressive and competitive. It's Holmes who gets the block. Five out. If, if you include Taylor Kissinger, who actually retired from basketball, Cool Bay starting the third quarter the way she started this game, and that's knocking down the three. Listen, let's listen. listen. I, got, I got the face. Yeah. <laughs> and Bourne doing it on one side, trying to take it all the way. Frenetic pace for both teams. Nebraska to end out the third quarter. Skagen is too strong. On the push, Patterson with the crossover. Beats the buzzer. Make sure that it's out of Danielle Patterson's hands. The guards were calling for it, but she said, no, no. I'm taking this up on my own. I'm make sure it's out of her hands at point two seconds on the clock. You have to bring it to the table on your own and expect your teammates to have that same love and fire as well. Cardano Hillary might have called me again that time on the penetration and she picks up another couple. Yeah, right here, Cardano Hillary, hey, she was played for the three. And that she made her debut against Tennessee in the last game that Indiana played. Was waiting for that waiver. There's a no look pass leading the break and it's more than with the finish. And finish strong at the rim and watch this. Cardano Hillary right there, boom, a bullet pass right into the pocket in transition. Push the tempo, why don't you? Oh.